Hello everyone and welcome to this course on Introduction to Game Theory and Mechanism Design. My name is Sopravanath and I am an Assistant Professor at the Computer Science Department at the Indian Institute of Technology, Kanpur. This short video is about the acknowledgement of the sources uh, that uh, this course has been made on and uh, also to give, give you some background information of how this was created. Uh, this was recorded as part of the course uh, CS711 at IIT Kanpur uh, with the same title and this was offered during the September to November semester of 2020. As you all know, this is the semester which has been badly uh, affected by the COVID-19 pandemic and therefore the lecture videos that has been recorded are not as professionally edited as it uh, could have been. But nevertheless, uh, this utilized the infrastructure and academic support of the institute and the institute had been pretty generous in permitting us for the public dissemination of the lecture content. If you are interested in the original course, uh, then you can actually look up this URL uh, where all the details, other details including the lecture notes are also posted. Now com coming to the content sources, this course has been benefited by several sources. Uh, so uh, the major part in the first uh, section of this course is uh, the, the game theory book by Michael Marshler, Ilan Solan and Shumel Zamir. The course has also had content from the multi-agent systems book by Yohab Shonham and uh, Kevin Leighton Brown. Also the game theory and mechanism design book by uh, Y Narahari. Uh, it has also been uh, greatly benefited by two lecture notes. Both were uh, from the Indian Statistical Institute on the, on the courses titled The Theory of Mechanism Design and the Indi Individual and Collective Choice offered by uh, Devashish Mishra and Arunavasen respectively. It has also uh, used some chapters of the preprints of the book Introduction to Economics and Computation by David C. Parks and Swen Suken. But uh, there were also some content which came from independent research papers which I have mentioned during the uh, respective modules of this course. So these are the major sources this course has been made of. Uh, but uh, there are there might be some other small resources which I have missed mentioning at this point. Uh, but they are all unintended omissions. So with that, uh, let me welcome you again and hope you'll enjoy this course.